Richard Maderley and Susanna Reid spoke with Conservative MP Crispin Blunt on Monday's Good Morning Britain. Richard Maderley sparked outrage on Monday's Good Morning Britain after he was accused by viewers of interrupting Conservative MP Crispin Blunt. Richard and Susanna Reid spoke with MP Blunt via video link about Reuters' report that the US, EYGPT, and Israel have agreed to a ceasefire in southern Gaza, coinciding with the reopening of the Rafah border crossing. However, during the chat, viewers became frustrated with Richard and Susanna for interrupting their guest. Many took to X, formerly known as Twitter, to share their frustrations over the interview. At Stephen Wilk 34988 fumed, I never thought he'd be defending a Tory, but what was the point of having him on the program when Partridge Susanna keep on interrupting talking over him all the time? Sick. At Big Mac underscore Billy echoed, for God's sake let the man speak. Why invite someone in, ask him questions then keep interrupting him whilst giving his answer? It's not all about you. Sick. At Mank Totter pleaded, please just shut Richard Maidley up. I just can't listen to Maidley when it's a conversation about a serious subject, he just tries to score points. Hashtag GMB, at Laird 01554927 went on to say. At Bindi12 commented, it would have been good to hear what Crispin Blunt had to say without the interruptions from Susanna and Richard. Sick. At Talbotothwell stepped in to defend the ITV host as they tweeted, Richard Maidley really is the best journalist ever. His intelligence and caring attitude put him way above any other. Thank you, Richard. During one part of the interview when the MP tried to speak, Richard interrupted, you had the attack last week. As MP Crispin tried to cut in, the ITV host went on, because you had the attack last weekend, which Susanna said was directly aimed at civilians. They were the targets, the children, the parents, and the families. Indeed, the MP weighed in before Richard interrupted again to get his point across. In another part of the chat, Susanna asked, can there be an unintended consequence here which is the opposite happens? Does support for hammers actually consolidate or grow as we attempt to obliterate them? We don't know which way that is going to go, MP Blunt explained. All we do know is that after the operation on Saturday, it should have been clear how shameful and shocking that was.